that shows is something else but i will not talk anything about it boska hata nifanye hivi si wamomo kudanganya wacha sasa tupelekane nao kotini that is defamation bro that is defamation Welcome back to our channel where we uncover the latest stories shaping our communities. Today, we're diving into the controversy surrounding the donations made in honor of the late Brian Chira. The unexpected passing of Brian Chira left a void that could never be filled. Known for his kindness and generosity, Brian's departure was mourned by all who knew him. To honor his memory and bid him a dignified farewell, Donations poured in from near and far, a testament to the impact he had on so many lives. However, what began as a noble endeavor soon descended into controversy. Allegations surfaced regarding the handling of the donations, with rumors swirling that Faustine, also known as Baba Talisha, had exerted undue influence over the funds. Brian's grandmother, a revered figure in the community, expressed her disappointment and concern over the lack of transparency surrounding the donations. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Her words struck a chord, sparking heated debates and online warfare on platforms like TikTok, where users passionately took sides and emotions ran high. Amidst the turmoil, elders performed cleansing rituals at Brian's grave and the surrounding compound, seeking to dispel any lingering negative energies from the turbulent burial. Yet, their efforts seemed futile in the face of the growing mistrust and betrayal surrounding Baba Talisha. Despite mounting criticism, Faustine remained defiant, posting cryptic messages on social media, asserting that kindness should never be regretted, even in the face of betrayal. So I'm not going, I'm not going to do anything. Yeah? Obidan is there, a kna truth watchdog with everybody. They have the access, they can go with that show show kwa bank, wa two statements zote, wende kwa mpesa statement, wa two pesa zote, pale wangalia statements. We have nothing, okay? So let them go and produce the statements wa kuja nazo. Yana di show show na sema ti pesa nilipua 40,000 nilikula nilienda nazo. Oh my goodness. As the dust settled, Faustine added fuel to the fire with a cryptic post on social media, stating, Never regret the kindness you showed somebody who didn't deserve it. They did you wrong, you did them right, and for that, you should be proud. This message sparked further debate and reflection among the community members, highlighting the complexities of forgiveness and compassion in the face of betrayal. As we continue on this journey of healing and reconciliation, let us stand united in our commitment to transparency and accountability. Like and subscribe to our channel to stay updated on the latest developments, and don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments below.